<coughs> so today's video is going to be about another stream fix that I bet a lot of people have ran into. If you haven't seen my first stream fix video, that's going to be in the link in the description below. That one's about the Logitech webcam and how to get 1080p quality on OBS. This video is for anybody who's streaming for the first time and is using OBS or Elgato as their streaming software and is wondering, hey, how come I'm not getting any sound from my gameplay? So this video is gonna solve that. Guys, let's get right into it. So before we start, I wanna show you how the PS4 works and how the actual problem comes about. So looking at your PS4, you have an input for your voice, which is your microphone, and an output for sound, which in most cases for traditional gamers, this all goes to your headphones. Then from here, we have the video output, which goes to your TV or monitor. And this is how most people play. They get their video from their monitor or TV, and then everything goes right back to their headphones and they just carry on playing. The problem is that when you do this, your TV or monitor is not gonna have any sound coming from it whatsoever. So all the sound instead is going to your headphones. Now this is the problem because the Elgato capture card is like a middleman in between your PS4 and your TV. So if there's sound that's not going through there, it's not gonna be recorded. So basically there's three ways you could fix this. Starting with number one, what you could do is go into your settings on your PS4 and switch the sound to come out of your TV. That way all the gameplay sound is gonna come through the TV and it's gonna get recorded by your capture card. The only problem with this is that you won't be using your headphones for anything except for the microphone input so you can talk to your teammates or randoms. In most cases I see people just say leave your headphones on your neck and just use your microphone like that but you're losing out on the advantages of having headphones to begin with. So now we're going on point number two and this one might be a little bit better. What you can do is plug your headphones directly into the TV or monitor. Now this solves most of the issue because now you're getting your sound going to your Elgato so you're gonna get that game sound and you're getting the sound to your headphones so now you can hear using your headphones. The only problem with this is that you won't be able to talk to your friends or randoms because your microphone is now plugged into the monitor instead of directly into your PS4. So there is a way you could combat this by plugging in an extra set of headphones into the PS4 and then just leaving it on the table so you can talk to people and this is a little weird but I, once again, I do see people do this. And also another big issue is that since your headphones are plugged in directly into the monitor, the sound coming to your headphones is actually not too good because think about it, the TV or monitor acts like an extra pass-through. So it's an extra layer that the sound has to go to before getting to your headphones. So it ends up not even sounding too good. Think about it like this. Let's say you're in a room that has surround sound and you have your phone and you're recording it, right? Now when you go to play back that audio recording from your phone, you're going to notice that it's not surround sound, it's going to sound flat. And that's exactly what happens here with the headphones. The sound to your headphones is going to come out flat and it's not going to be as good as when you plug the headphones directly into the PS4. Now the third option, which I highly recommend and I think everybody should use, is to plug in an amplifier to your PS4. And by amplifier, you could use any standard amplifier, but what I recommend using is an Astro Mix Amp. This allows you to get surround sound quality. So not only does it allow the gameplay to be sound to your headphones, but it also amplifies the sound so you can hear crisp surround sound in your headphones. And for some reason this is possible because the PS4 has an option that you can choose between HDMI or optical, which really means HDMI and optical because not only is the sound coming out to your TV, your monitor, but it's also coming to your headphones. So this solves your problem with your sound going to your Elgato, so your Elgato will pick up the game sound, but you will also hear the game sound to your headphones. The only con of this is that you do have to buy the amplifier or the mix amp, and I know these things aren't cheap, so that's an extra expense that you will have to incur. But if you got this far into wanting to stream, I mean, might as well just buy it. I mean, not only will it allow you to stream, but it'll also enhance the quality of the sound. That way you can win more gunfights. And I bet your stream would like that better too. Another con to using an amplifier is that you can't use USB headphones that use a USB input or USB wired headphones which don't have a detachable option like this one. So this is another thing to consider as well. But let me know in the comment section down below if this helped whatsoever and don't forget to like and subscribe for more content just like this. This is Matthew guys, peace out.